All right, guys, it's almost here. A few hours away. The 26th, it's on its way. Patch notes are out. Hey, let's dig in. All right, all right, all right. So here we go. This is on uh, Discord and uh, the uh, November 25, which is today, and then tomorrow will be the global release. It's already happening, guys. Let's go. So Satsuki here says, welcome to the official global launch of Shining Beyond. Thank you. Let's see what the new features are. New limited time event, Thanksgiving feast, and collection ladder event. Do we have any pictures of that? No? Okay. Maybe I'll check, I'll check the, um, the Facebook page as well. But right now, they have a Thanksgiving thing, and I'm okay with it. Introducing new Acolyte class hero, uh, Domenico? Domenico? And it's an SSR. Cool, cool. We like SSRs. Uh, new school costume, Makacho Sukiha. Sukiha? An SR? Okay, so new school costume. Okay, 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 okay. So this is just a skin for an SR, which... Uh, they need to stop giving SRs um, skins. No matter whether they're free or pay or draw or event they need to stop doing that because the srs are remember they're capped guys don't fall for this trap of six starring because you're not going to go beyond on an sr they're only going to when they get to six star they're going to be ssr and that's it there's there's no seven or eight or nine star just don't don't fall for that trap the skins are cool collect them if you can but there's no point in even trying Global launch giveaway calendar 14 days, so there's going to be a giveaway, which is nice. A new Christmas background theme, I'm with it. New campaign difficulty, master mode. So summoning, summoning and rates increased for Domenico and Makato. Makoto? Uh, Domenico, Domenico is probably Dominican, maybe? Dominicano! <laughs> Can only be summoned via Domenico's featured summon banner. Uh, wow. Dominico's shards are only available on the summon milestone banner. Okay, okay, that's okay. So the miles, the the, the mileage is basically when you get to like a um, hundred pulls or ten pulls, ten straight pulls, which is a hundred. Every ten pull, you you're basically earning mileage, and that mileage goes to a ticket that you can summon the you know the shards for the for this character, which which you know kind of hurts because you can't you can't you know, dissolve characters that you have access of, if I'm reading this right, to give it to Domenico. So hopefully Domenico is like this really badass character. Um, right now, TBD. Oh yeah, right now TBD, because it, <laughs> it, it, it's not here. All right, so new, where are we at? No, 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 not new yet. Hold up, not new yet. Limited time event, 26th to the, to the 10th of December, despite the closing winter, uh, in a village still plagued by war, Empire soldiers pillaged the uh, lonesome villages, villagers, leaving them in the brink of starvation. Thankfully, our new hero, Master Chef Domenico, is here to save the day. With bounty hunter Makato to aid him to hunt the tall crested turkey. <laughs> all right, let, all right. Let's see what the event is. Thanksgiving feast and collectible ladder will be available at player level 15, which is really easy to do. 15, no problem. Now, this if this event is anything like the previous events, make sure you spend it. You you you, you spend your keys, especially if there's like a skin. I think I could have got it. I was I was really close. I was like at like 3,200. Every key that I didn't spend and every hot time that I didn't spend could have been easy money for that skin. Now, granted, the skin that I was looking for is a one of, in one of my videos. It, it didn't matter. It, it was for an SR character, I believe, so it, it, it didn't matter. And if it... So, anyway, let's see what I have here. Um, so, new quest, Thanksgiving Feast. Event section has been updated. Clear all the missions and claim the limited time milestones. Okay. The Great Turkey Hunt. Collect the... Prize golden turkey and reach to the top of the ladder, which is going to be tough. I bet you it's going to be tough. Every every golden turkey collected will be added into the collection ladder, where players will race to collect the most, obtain awesome prizes such as hero costumes. Yes, but please make them SSRs. Oh, they, they've already made it. So I hope. I hope that they're fucking SSR shards uh, costumes because. 
again it sucks when you you can't rock you know these really cool costumes on srs uh hero shards uh maybe i should have done this too but summon tickets and many more from the collection ladder after it ends okay 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 where am i because i lose my place easily updated event shop collect the event token turkey as much as you can and exchange them in the event in the event shop to get the exclusive Mikado school costume. Is Mikado a chick or a dude? I can't tell. Grade up items, rare gear, uh, weapon selector, and many more. Limited buff time. Gain 20% more event tokens when you have Nico in your squad. And 10% Nico, dude. Please, Nico. Please, Nico. Don't be a... Don't be a, an, an SR. Please. God. Event token when you have Mikado in the squad. Okay, so you get you get bonuses if you if you have these characters. Limited time event forge. Actually, yeah, because um, when I was using um, Artemis, I was getting bonuses too. But it's crazy that the the tokens that I was that they were dropping it was like still like twenty and like twenty per. Oof, I I don't want to sound like I'm bitching, but they're stingy. They are stingy when they're dropping these tokens. Man, wow, <laughs> like let it go. Remember to claim from your mailbox uh, energy meal meal giveaways three times a day during the event. Oh. Kato, that, this is for you, uh, not for you, but this is for me. <laughs> for the morning at 4 a.m., which I'm not going to be at, up at 4 a.m., <clears throat> lunch at 12 p.m., that's nice, dinner at 8 p.m., uh, GMT. So we have added a third meal time giveaway for our players from different time zones. Thank you. Thank you. But honestly, you it shouldn't even be about time zones like that. It should be like, I mean, it should be time zones. It should be like locations. So it should be like one around like, like a like eight to eight to like ten, and then from like twelve to three, and then from like five to eight or something like that. That's that. That would be nice. That would be ideal, because then you 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 cover people waking up in the morning. You cover people at lunch, and then you cover people having you know uh, dinner or something like that. So that'd be nice, but. Maybe that's what the global thing is gonna help out with uh, the new the new G2 or yeah the G2 the global two um, and the new G2 server. Event energy token resets daily. Yep. If you purchase any extras or obtain them through forges, please remember to use them before the daily reset. Ooh, you lose them. Shizu school costume in Sakura Dance bundle in the shop. Shizu school costume in Sakura Dance bundle shop. Mikado school costume and black flower maiden bundle in the shop. You can also visit the event shop and exchange turkey event tokens for Mikado school costume. Grab the event exclusive daily turkey. So this, okay, this is all this stuff. Let's see if they have anything that they really, really changed. Uh, miscellaneous new campaign difficulty. Okay. Battle pass. Uh, a new limited time battle pass is available for the 30th on the 30th of, of November. Be sure to check the treasure to claim free rewards. A special one-time step-up summon will be available to players. Obtain an SSR ticket, Thanksgiving boxes, hero tickets uh, with a chance of SSR and phase school costume. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Active hero skill runes for Leon, Jenny, Emiko, and Thea have added had been added to the raid shop. Okay. Okay. Level. Uh, let me see. Bug fixes and changes. Level players level now increase from 100 to 130 uh, I never I never got to 100 so okay they I guess that was an issue or just change that was probably just a change all arena progress will be reset for both league rankings and milestone rewards all players will start from bronze and will be able to so that's cool because now I get I get more points so it, it works for us old veteran people all these all these boomers these shining beyond boomers <laughs> Uh, quality of life, equipped weapon and rune will no longer, uh, no longer counted into inventory. Yes. Okay, good. Inventory. Now I have space because a lot of my characters, man. And this is actually okay. So check it out, guys. This is actually good. This is really useful because if you have a lot of characters and you don't use them at all, you can at least have them hold your equipment for a later time. I like it. I like it because that that's really helpful. It, it's a, a free expanse. You know what I mean? The more characters come out, the more you get them. Hold this, hold this bag for me. You know what I mean? So that's that, I like that. Um, friend search will be limited to the to the first thirty results. Friend and guild. I don't like their friend system. I want a button that just just adds everybody. 
because there's a lot of people that aren't playing and if there's a lot of people that aren't playing i just want to focus the ones that are so it'd be great if there was like a search like people that are playing after a certain while after a certain while of uh inactivity that'd be great if like the algorithm knew okay this person's afk hard or just he's just not even playing period so it's been two three three days he, their person's not going to show up and they don't show up on the thing so you can add the people that are actually you know you know very very active that's that's how it should be but i don't make games i, I only uh, play them <laughs> Though maybe one day, who knows? Friend and guild search will now work properly without have at, without having errors on punctuation. Okay. Multiple item selector is now available. Thank you. You saw. Oh my god. Ha. Thank you. This is this is definitely a quality of life because I literally opened every single box of Artemis's weapon and it took me like five minutes. <laughs> so this is nice that you can be like check. Okay, I need you know x x amount and boom. Auto repeat button is available on pre battle page. Auto repeat will only work on the following modes: story, daily dungeons, events. Okay, an auto repeat button, guys. Yo, let's go, let's go, let's get this shit, son. Cause then now again, put it off to the side. Look at dude, do the thing you gotta do over here. You're done with the thing you gotta do over here. You gotta come back over here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> auto transfer will active activate to the most active player if the guild master is inactive that's awesome you see what i'm saying so if they could do that for the guild they can do that for the friends if they can bump the guild lead leader because he ain't playing no more and it goes to the net the most active player that's actually legit because now you can actually inherit you can inherit a guild uh, you can inherit a guild guys how cool is that? Okay, okay, that is really cool. I don't think I've ever seen a game do that, ever. Yes, wow, okay, right here. Woo. Tower of Oblivion and Tower of Trials have been removed and replaced with the new towers named Saviors, Stairways, and Spire of Trials. There are new tower floors added and with more rewarding and challenging at the upper levels. So what happens to the other stuff? I don't know. Tower, the Spire of Trials can be manually reset after 30 days to floor one tower the spire of trials is that one of these yeah okay so activating this reset will affect all class spires and reset them to the first floor do you get all the stuff do you get all the stuff that you you collected i don't know uh forge rebalancing the forge cost needed for hero shards and made adjustments to the forging cost of sr and ssr tickets i wonder if it costs more <laughs> Cause uh, you know, at, you know, when your when your when your wallet is like Naruto's wallet when it was like stolen <laughs> when all his money was ripped off by Jiraiya, you are trying to penny pinch and you're like, man, I'm trying to collect these SSR tickets and that's like, fuck, I, I I don't have anything. Skills fix the issues of Kane's skill and Athena's skill. Athena had problems. Kane's destructive nexus is now a single multi-target uh, circle with the burning ground effect. At level 6 and above, Kane will also gain a status shield, making him immune to negative statuses. Okay, so what Athena's hero skill reflect ability will now work properly without crashing the game. What? She was crashing the game? <laughs> yeah, that's 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 nice. That's definitely a bug fix. Uh, skill defense. Adjustments were made to skill defense. Skill defense should now be more effective based on the uh the open beta test feedback skill defense okay all right skill effects over time uh all damage ticks in game are adjusted from one second per tick to two seconds per tick based on obt feedback okay uh, uh other adjustments were made to the following areas based on data gathering from obt Battle items, idle reward shops, talent level rewards, job mastery, gear, advanced stats, and daily, weekly, monthly requests, all that good stuff. Remove limited time event, Temple of the Sins. Bye. Thea and Artemis' feature hero banner has been removed. Wah. Um, event wishing altar has also been removed. You know what sucks about all that? I didn't spend any of that currency. I didn't spend it. I was gonna log in today and play, and then I got I got distracted with some things I had to do, IRL stuff, and when I got to the thing, oh, 
it was already doing the update and stuff and it was telling me Ma, nah bro you can't get in so you know <laughs> you just, that's it you ain't get it so that's fine guys good things good things they have a lot of good things coming in again the highlight right now to me is the guild the items some of the resets are really nice because the resets give you more stuff they do uh if you get to the top and you get to reset it on a monthly basis you, you, you know you're gonna climb it so uh all in all i like it i like it guys have fun when you guys wake up in the morning and you can finally boom plug that some bitch up and you guys are gonna have a blast i know you will i know you will because I, I i'm i'm gonna load up and i'm gonna be like yeah i can't wait to see all the good and new stuff so it's been ojt holla and it's all i got